Hello guys, welcome back to the OK channel with me, Felicia. Um, yeah, so today I'm going to show you a video of makeup tutorial for New Year's. So sorry that I forgot to put on the intro video, but let's just get into the video. So this is my bare face. I have put on some contact lenses and um, just going to get my hair out of my face. I'm going to tie it and then I am going to put on a hairband. I am going to start pre preparing my skin with um, essence toner from Pyun Kang Yul. I put it on a cotton pad and then I'm just going to rub it all over my face this toner is just um, hydrating my face very well and it makes my skin smoother next up I'm going to use Neutrogena moisturizer after I put on the toner I am just going to apply it all over my face with my fingers Next up, I'm going to use a lip balm from Mentholatum Lip Balm. It has like some kind of like mint effect on your lips. Next up, um, I'm going to apply some sunscreen on my face to protect my skin after applying the moisturizer. Next up, I'm going to use a primer from Benefit. It's called the Pore Professional. Um, primer is um, used to make uh, the pores instantly appear smaller on camera. I am just going to apply this primer on my T-zone, especially on my nose area because it gets very oily. And then I am going to use um, Cleo Kill Cover Fawn Wear Cushion I use the darkest shade that I can find on the store It's the third shade um, which is called Linen This foundation has a light to medium cover It can cover the redness on my face and also very light to use for daily As you can see here that I applied a little too much on my forehead but if you do that too, don't worry, you can blend it out later. And then I am just going to continuing um, dapping the foundation into my skin using the sponge I usually use because I am not used to um, um, wear that with the sponge from the cushion and the next step I am going to apply um, concealer under my eyes just to um, conceal the imperfections on my skin I really love this concealer. It just cover all of my uh, redness or and even my um, you know like black spot and also my um, pimples. I drag it down to my lips just to cover up the color so that when I apply some lipsticks or tints that it will make the colors of the lipsticks um, stand out even more a little tips when applying concealer 
you don't want to drag your concealer but just slightly dab it on into your skin after that I am going to use the setting spray for NYX after applying my concealer next up I'm going to apply some contour um, from the contour palette from City Color it's just going to define my um, cheekbones and my jawline area Next, I'm going to use another clean brush. I'm going to take a small amount of the product and then just applying it on my nose. Just make the illusions that um, it is not um, flat. <laughs> After I've done my face, now I start with my brows. I'm just going to brush it out with the spoolie on the um, pencil. And then I am going to draw from the front first. And then just drag it down to the back of my um, brows. I am using Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Diviner in the shade of Tall. And then I am taking another small brush and a little bit of the concealer and then I am going to apply it under my brows just to clean it up uh, the mess that I made after um, divining my brows. Then I am taking a clean sponge and then lightly dab it on the concealer just to blend it a little. I am using the Carly Bible eyeshadow palette and also it has highlighters on it. Um, I am using that shade. I'm taking an eyeshadow brush and then just apply it all over my lips. Blend, blend, and blend. I am applying it not really close to my uh, lash line because I am going to apply some glitter on it er, uh, later. And then I am taking the highlighter shade and I am just going to use my finger to apply it on my um, lid. With a small brush, I am going to um, take some the some of the highlighter and then apply it in the 
on the inner corner of my eyes and on my um, brow bone. And then I am going to take um, the dark, a little darker shade um, just to apply it on the outer corner of my eyes and on my um, lower lash line. Next, with this Esca liner, I am going to line up my eyes. Um, I am putting it as close um, as I can with my lash line. Then curling up my lashes with this curler, I am going to apply some mascara on. Oh right, um, I am going to apply some glitter onto my lids, but I think you should apply it before um, eyeliner because it will blur out the liner a little bit and then I am going to dab it just like that onto the other eye too. As you can see that I put a little too much on my left eye, but don't worry, um, this glitter won't um, give you fallout so I think you can clean it with clean tissue or clean pads I am making as soft as I can for my eye look because I am going to give some statement onto my lips just make it pop a little and then I am going to apply some um, fake lashes it's just very natural lashes for my eyes um, you can say that my eye look is kind of soft glam look because it's very soft but it will also look um, glam because you know the blinks After I done with my eye look, now it's time for a blush. I use this Benefit blush um, in shade um, Dandelion from Benefit. After I'm done with my blush, now it's time for highlighters. Uh, I used the shades I earlier put on my eyes 
for my cheeks um, and then for my um, nose on top of my lips and also on my chin there I put a little too much on my chin but it's okay I can just or you can just um, take another clean brush or sponge another clean sponge and then just blend it out and then for the lips I am going to use these products from second date first one I am going to apply so, uh, the lip tints in the shade of brunch all over my lips and then on top of that I am going to use the lip gloss in shade Moon River I really love the color of this lip tints um, it's kind of like orangey but it has pink on it like peachy color Then on top of the lip tints, I am going to apply some gloss on it. Oh wait, um... To finish the look, I am going to set it up with setting spray from NYX again and then I am just going to push my lashes up. Alright, so this is the finished look for the New Year's Eve makeup tutorial. I created a soft glam look with peachy lips um, you can wear this to you know dinner with your closest ones your family hope you like it don't forget to like subscribe and drop a comment down below thank you happy new year bye bye